Welcome to the ceramic mopping instructional video brought to you by Flower City Arts Center. Here's Malia, she just finished working and is about to start mopping. First, she checks the mop bucket to see if it's clean. It looks good. It is counterproductive to clean a floor with dirty water. Now she will begin filling the bucket with the hose attached to the sink. She would then check the mop to see if it's dirty. She decides to give it a quick rinse. Now she is ready to begin. Leo will go to one side of the room to start mopping. She will dip her mop bucket into the water until it's sopping wet. This is a wet mop. When wet mopping, there should be a thin veneer of water over the surface of the floor. She wet mops the first quarter of the room, then wrings out all the water. Giving it a twist helps get off the water. Once she gets out all the water, the mop is dry. This is called dry mopping. She will work backwards, as to not walk over the area she has already cleaned. Ah, look at that shine. She will repeat this process, the wet mopping and dry mopping, over the second quarter of the room. Now for the dry mopping. Now Malia takes the opportunity to check her mop water. Gross. Take the mop bucket back to the sink to clean it. Be sure to remove the wringer, dump the dirty clay water, and clean it with the hose. This is what you want. This is what you don't want. Now she has to put the wringer back onto the bucket. Bind the side of the bucket with the two little tabs, then slide it on gracefully. You should not have to force it. Here's another technique. Andy has come on the scene to assist. He begins to wet mop, then Malia follows with the dry mop. Let's watch and enjoy the music and efficiency. Looking good, Andy and Malia. But they are celebrating too soon. Malia and Andy must clean up the cleaning supplies. Malia returns to the sink, where she wrings out the mop, gives it a bit of a twist. No drips. Then she removes the wringer from the mop bucket. But wait, Malia can't lift the bucket by herself. She asks for Andy's assistance. They bend at the knees and lift the bucket together. Then clean out the bucket with the hose. Now the bucket is clean for the next person to use.